you guys so welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi hello welcome my name is lauren you should definitely subscribe <laughs> Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, hello, welcome. My name is Lori and you should definitely subscribe to my channel. Today is a very much needed night because I officially ended my week. I'm super excited. I do not have any exams, papers, none of that things are due. I'm done. I'm just waiting for my grades at this point. School is done. I am still working though, but I just got off of work. Because of this, I get to do all the things that I didn't get to do. Now we're gonna do some waxing, okay? We're also going to be doing our skincare routine even though it's not necessarily a skincare routine because some things that I'm trying out, so I don't know how it's doing for me, but we are working with what we got. Okay guys, so right now I'm heating up the wax. It looks like that. I'm also freezing right now like it's super cold in this room hey guys so welcome I am back with the voiceover so right now I'm basically brushing my eyebrow hairs in one direction so that I am able to cut the long hairs that are sticking out I then proceed to brush my hair in the opposite direction and cut whatever is sticking out I got this idea from someone but unfortunately I forgot who it was but ever since then this has been working out for me whenever I am waxing I grab a bag full of cotton balls which is specifically for for whenever I'm waxing because I do use cotton balls for whenever I do my nails. That is why I keep it separate so that I know I have cotton balls for waxing. I use a before and after spray when I'm waxing which came with the product so I am using it. I don't know if it actually helps or if it does anything. I just use it to clean the area that I'm working with. Before I put the hot, I'm supposed to the hot, I test the wax in my hand to see if I can handle the hotness before putting it on my face so that way I do not burn myself because I have done it multiple times before and and it is not fun at all. When I'm waxing, I like to let it sit for a couple of seconds and then proceed with pulling the wax strip off. I pull in the opposite direction of where the hair is growing so that way I am getting everything from the root. I also like to keep take deep breaths in and out before pulling because it's painful when you haven't waxed in a while. Okay guys, so eyebrows are done. They're looking clean. I'm gonna go be finishing my dinner upon I'll catch up with you guys again. After I shower, I basically brush my teeth and add this first retinol body lotion baby oil on my feet to make it soft I'm not sure if it actually helps but I think it helps I also use Olaplex number no. 6 and number no. 7 mixed together and evenly let it sit on my hair while I do my skincare routine <laughs> I'm using the Pore Care Face Mask by Tony Moly, which is my favorite brand if I haven't mentioned that already. I use the 10 Step Korean Skin Care Routine, which is basically oil-based cleanser, water-based cleanser, exfoliator, toner, essence water treatments, sheet mask, eye cream, moisturizer, and SPF in the AM only in this order. The way I learned to layer all these products is by tapping it gently onto the face, like so. There's a whole reason to it, but I'm not sure who said it. Um, but like I've mentioned before, but since then, it's been working out for me and I've stuck with it. If y'all have any suggestions what else I should do for my self-care night routines, let me know. I am open to suggestions. <laughs> After my skincare routine, I brush my hair and put it in a bonnet to keep my hair away from my face at night. And that's basically my self-care night. That is basically 
basically the ending of today's video. I hope y'all enjoy. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!